Okay, uh, let's look at the homework 1.7, uh, problem number 4, right? So we have this limit, uh, uh, 2x minus 3, as x approaches 4, is equal to 5. So we want to illustrate the definition by finding the corresponding delta value um, for these epsilon values, right? So let's do that. All right, so uh, let's, uh, let's see. Definition was for all epsilon greater than zero, there exists a delta positive such that, right, uh, if, as long as x is, the distance between x and 4 is less than delta, this implies that uh, the function value, in this case, at 2x minus 3, and the five distance is less than epsilon, right? So let's uh, start with the conclusion we want to make so that we can find the formula for delta, right? So uh, start with this. So I'm going to have uh, 2x. I'm going to go ahead and uh, combine them. So it's going to be minus 8 is less than epsilon, right? Then I'm going to just uh, divide through by 2. And that way you can get uh, absolute value x minus 4 is less than uh, epsilon over 2. All right. Now we already know what the delta is. So you can see that uh, you can match this guy with that guy. All right. So it seems like uh, in order to find a delta value, you just have to take the half of the uh, corresponding epsilon value. All right. So uh, let's do that. All right, so if it's uh, point, 0 0.5, it's going to be half of that is 0 0.25. And if it's 0 0.1, I'll put the 0 0.05. And the 0 0.05, then that will be 0 0.025. All right, so let's check the answer. All right. All right, it came back and looks like uh, we got this one correctly. All right, that's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.